All right, so this question here, it's a quadratic equation and you want to find some key points on that quadratic equation. The height of the bridge where the rock was thrown from, the maximum height of the rock, and how far across it moves. So the best thing to do is to sketch it and then make decisions after that. So new document, press the number one. Uh, do you want to save? No, I do not. Two to add a graph. All right, and now it's negative eight x squared plus 8x plus 3.5 and we have this nice little graph here. I probably couldn't have done that any prettier if I'd tried. Now the height of the bridge. Now the height of the bridge is the place where it was thrown from and it's right right there. So what I'm going to do is just a trace. All right, I'm just going to do a graph trace. Okay now you can see oh it tells me the y intercept. Now I'm just arrowing across. I'm just using these two arrows here. 0, 3.5. 3.5 is the height of the bridge. Now we want the maximum height of the rock. Let's see what our trace does. There we go. We just moved across and we traced and we got 0 0.5, 5.5. I'm going to show you a second way to do that just in case trace doesn't doesn't give it, give it to you. So 0 0.5, 5.5 for that answer there. And the last one, there we go, uh, 1.329. This number here, one negative 1.998 times 10 to the negative 12, that's zero, right? That's as close to zero as you could possibly get. So our intercept is 1.329 approximately. Now there are other ways to do what I've just done. We can say, uh, analyze the graph and we can look for the maximum. Now we need to look for a lower bound and an upper bound and there's our maximum, 0 0.5, 5.5. We found that using trace. We can also analyze our graph and look for our zeros. Again, a lower bound, an upper bound. And you can see it spat out one zero, 1 1.3290. If I want my other one, I just analyze my graph again. And this time I'll just go from here to here because that'll pick up that zero right there. Okay, and you can see it's a little bit hard to tell what's going on there. So we might need to refresh that screen to take a better look at those numbers. But we can see that without trace anyway. All right, there are three answers, relatively easy. Make sure that you mention that you've used graphics calculator and uh, sketched it and traced it. And if you're feeling excited, maybe just a quick little sketch of what that quadratic looks like. Uh, that's got a maximum height of 5.5, that was 1.329, and this number here was 3.5. Alright, that's uh, graphing and then finding some key points.